Catwoman versus Black Cat. In one corner we have one of Batman's greatest opponents and loves, Selina Kyle. And in the other we have world renowned cat burglar daughter Felicia Hardy. Both are characters based on one of the most YouTubeable animals out there. But in a showdown between the two, who will win? We're about to find out. Welcome back, Nerd Squad. My name is Roya Destroya, and this is Top 10 Nerd Series Versus, where we take your favorite characters and pit them in battle to see who comes out on top. Before we begin, let us know who you think will be a winner with the hashtag in the comment section. Will it be hashtag Catwoman or hashtag Black Cat? Let's get brawling. So before we get into the cat fight of the century, we're going to take a look into both these ladies' lives and get to know what they're all about. Selina Kyle has been around in comic books ever since the early 40s. She started off as a jewel thief known as the Cat, although she had yet to wear her signature skin tight cat suit. In fact, she was disguised as an elderly woman on the heist where she is first introduced to us. According to one of the many, many stories told about Selina, she turned to a life of theft because she enjoyed stealing back her own jewelry from her ex-husband so much. Of course, she has had several several different retcons of her origin, but the basis behind Catwoman has remained the same, a butt kicking femme fatale who makes use of a variety of weapons, including her own bare hands with ease and deadliness. Now for Felicia Hardy, she was born to a dad who pretended to be a salesman but was actually a big time cat burglar who taught her always, always aim for the top. He left some pretty big paws to fill. In university, she was raped by her boyfriend Ryan, an event that influences her to train in various forms of combat. After so much time spent training, she planned to seek revenge until Ryan was killed in a drunk driving incident. While it worked out in the end for her, she did feel kinda cheated out of the chance to off him herself. Rather than waste everything she trained herself to do, she decided the next best thing was to become a burglar just like daddy. So now that we know what's behind these fierce felines, we gotta take a look at what they can do with those claws. Catwoman herself doesn't have any real superpowers, but what she lacks in the super, she makes up for in the power. She's trained in a multitude of martial arts, including karate, jiu-jitsu, and boxing. Coupled with her stealth ability, she can land a pretty heavy hit without someone even seeing it coming. Now if her fighting ability was just commonplace for you, she amps up her game with a variety of tech and paraphernalia. Among some of her most famous tech are clawed gloves, her ensnaring ropes, and of course the classic whip, and not the kind that you want to see a woman in a skin tight costume using. Now her obvious weakness is, aside from the unruly golden retriever at times maybe, is she doesn't actually have any superpowers, and sometimes technology can only take you so far. But as we have learned from her oftentimes partner Batman, a little tech can go a long way as long as you know what you're up against. On the other paw, Black Cat does have a superpower. Wanting to become a superpowered individual equal to Spider-Man, she accepted an offer from Kingpin to put her through the same process that created Human Fly and Scorpion. Now she can control probability and not always consciously. Even though she considers friends may eventually fall to a stream of bad luck if they spend too much time around her, such as car accidents or weapon malfunctions. If that's not enough to protect her, she's always got all that fighting training she underwent. She is in fact considered an Olympic level athlete, and she's not without her own little devices too, such as agility enhancing earrings and grappling hook gloves. As for weaknesses, the two emotions that drive her most frequently are anger and jealousy. She couldn't bear the thought of Spider-Man loving someone other than her. She can't bear the thought of revenge left, and these two things oftentimes cause her to be just a little reckless. So who who would win in a showdown? Well, let's set up the scene here. Because we know both women have an affinity for possessions and a love of robbery, the most likely scenario where they would come into contact would be on the same heist. For fun, let's say they've broken into the house of a very old but very rich widow with a beautiful jewelry collection, one that both cats have set their sights on. Black Cat is approaching the chest where the widow keeps her goods, so focused on those pretty jewels when out of nowhere Catwoman drops on top of her. After pulling herself away from her adversary, Black Cat gets into trapped in a fist fight with Catwoman. Claws and fur are flying and Catwoman's just a titch above at this point. Remember, we're talking about a lady who beat three flashes at once at one point in Batman number 42. Suddenly, she gets a foot cramp. Out of nowhere, right? What bad luck. She misses a step and Black Cat takes it as a chance to knock her off her feet and swipe the jewelry. She's headed for the window when Catwoman pulls out her trusty bolus to ensnare her foe. But just her luck, they're tangled. This has never happened before, honestly. Well, with that waste the time Black Cat has made it out the window onto the roof and has used her suit's grappling hook to swing away as fast as she could, leaving Catwoman jeweless and a little confused about her rotten luck. The winner, Black Cat. It 
It's like they say, never let a black cat cross your path. That is it for verses here today. Let us know in the comment section whose corner you were in. Hashtag Catwoman or hashtag Black Cat. My name is Rory Destroya. Thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe so you never miss another nerdy video.